Jonathan Cannons here from Massive Gold Blueprint with another Pipeline of the Day gold making tip for you. And today I'm looking at Illusion Dust. Illusion Dust is a fairly decent moving quantity level uh, enchanting material from Old World pre-level 60 times. And one of the reasons this turns into a good pipeline opportunity is because it's quite often available, it's up for sale on the auction house for uh, prices that are really too low. And that's simply because, as so often the case with materials that are in the pre-level 60 era from the original game, uh, they're quite often undervalued by players who don't realize that uh, there's a strong demand for some of these older items for, for leveling and for uh, enchanting or for trade crafting that uh, makes items that are still very valuable in the game in spite of the fact that uh, they're from long ago. And uh, a lot of players tend to focus on just what's most recent in the game, for instance. And so tons of opportunities with the older uh, mid-level trade goods. Uh, this is especially true with enchanting materials, also with uh, both metals and with herbs. But anyway, coming back to Illusion Dust, you can see that right now there's not a heck of a lot available on the auction house, this auction house. There's uh, quite a lot of singles, stacks of one at around five gold, and then some stacks of ten going up as high as seven or eight gold as the offer price. And if I look at uh, my auctionator buy list, Here's my enchanting materials buy list and pull up illusion dust. It gives you a bit clearer picture of how much is available or how little is available, really. That's not much given that illusion dust on, on most servers with a reasonable level acti of activity will probably sell something like 10 to 15 stacks of 20 of illusion dust per day. Uh, maybe a little less than that on a typical server, but on a high population server, certainly there will be that much uh, on, a, on a good day. And uh, so now I'll just show you the opportunity. The, I, I mentioned that they're often undervalued. So have a look at the price that I'm actually paying. In bean counter, you can see that I've been buying fairly consistently and frequently, mostly in singles, as it turns out, um, at the price of two gold. And so quite a lot. I've got tons and tons of it that I bought at that price. You can see just scrolling down the list. And then you can see that further back I was selling around four to five gold, quite a lot of it, in stacks of five. That's my favorite price, <laughs> or favorite stack size actually for best results with a lot of enchanting materials. Okay, so that's a pretty good picture of how things are looking. And so my current price, if I switch back over to appraiser, which is what I use for posting most of the time, I'm selling stacks of five again at 576 which gives uh, you know one of my nice price points this is 28 gold 80 buyout for a stack of five and just to show you just to verify this uh, for you I'll um, go and pick up some in the mailbox I know I've just sold a few pretty much I can put up 10 stacks a day of 10 stacks of five and easily sell them if I'm just logging in a couple of times a day. So you can see that, here we go, there's my stacks of five of Illusion Dust they've been selling at that price. And if I put them up at that price today, I know they'll sell even though there's quite a lot available still under five gold. There's enough demand and the supply is short enough that they will definitely move today. So there's your tip. Check out Illusion Dust on your server and keep an eye on it. Watch for times when you can buy it down in that sort of one to two gold range, let's say. Pretty much a gimme at that price. And uh, then bide your time and wait for the supply to dwindle and then sell it off at four or five or six gold a piece. And stacks of five are the way to go. Okay, here's a summary of today's pipeline of the day. Your target buy price, two gold target sell price of five gold. I'm recommending stack sizes, usually five stacks, but you could also do singles, especially if the prices are driving higher than the five gold level. The sales volume is medium. You might see 10 plus stacks per day moving on a busy server. That's stacks of 20 if you want to count it that way. And the sales cycle, which is pretty important to be aware of, it's intermittent and kind of unpredictable. Uh, you'll probably see buying opportunities a couple of times per month at the low end at that two gold target buy price. And then you have to bide your time for selling opportunities. You might have to wait a couple or four weeks before your price comes up.
And finally, for more Pipeline of the Day, I post every day on Twitter, and you can search for that tag, Pipe OTD. Here's the Twitter feed. It's just twitter.com forward slash secret warcraft. And if you want to get the lowdown on what is a pipeline, it's an entire method. And I have a complete video guide, uh, more than 100 hours of video teaching Auction House Mastery My Way. It's a unique system that I've developed. It's at massivewowgold.com.